stopped at 775 instead of changing it back to 74 because I don't want to touch it again tonight. It's strange because last year we had to put a new air conditioning in. So it should be good, right? But then the beginning of this summer we had a lightning strike close by that put the breaker out. And for some strange reason I couldn't get the breaker to turn back on. I tried I don't know how many times and it kept just springing back off. So I had to have them come out and check it. The tech comes in, turns the breaker all the way off because apparently it was in the middle between off and on, turns it all the way off, flips it on, it stays on, everything's fine. A hundred dollars for him to come out and turn the breaker on for me. Well, he did say he had to add some Freon, too. He said sometimes when they put them in, they don't, they are completely full, so. Whatever, $100, and a guy turned the breaker back on for me after two days of no air conditioning. So it freaks me out when it's not working right. Because I remember that week when we had to get a new one it was like the heat index was 105 and I had no air conditioning. That sucked. I know other places, people, it gets hotter than that and they don't have any air conditioning. That's awful. I don't know how you'd do it. So hopefully, being I put fresh new Energizer batteries instead of dollar store batteries in there, hopefully it'll be okay now. Or I'll need a new thermostat. And new thermostat isn't super expensive, but I don't want to have to do that. So let's hope this works. So I keep going and looking at it to make sure it's on. Because last week I went, looked at the thermostat, and it wasn't lit up at all. But the air was running. It was weird. So I put new batteries in, and then it didn't work right at first, and I freaked out. And then, it's been working fine since. Actually, I think that was two weeks ago, so for two weeks it's been working fine. But I bought the new batteries, so I could put them in if I needed to. And it looks like I needed to. I just don't know how it went from fan on auto to fan completely on. Because I did not touch that button, that is a different button on the other side of the thermostat. Somehow, maybe if the batteries weren't working right, or if the battery pack wasn't in there right, I'm thinking maybe that might have bumped it. Hopefully. We'll see, it's pretty cool in here right now. It's cooling off tonight, it's only 70 degrees. So at least I don't need the air right now. Hopefully tomorrow when I need it, it comes back on. But you can bet when I'm done making videos, I'll be out there checking it again. So there was my adventure for today.
it's nice to have a female version. I mean, I love Denzel Washington, but it's also nice to see a woman kicking ass.
I like her. If you've seen it, you know. So I don't watch a lot of regular shows while I'm watching all these TikTok stuff. And I read a lot. I have Kindle Unlimited, so I read as many books as I can. Sometimes I read regular books, you know, regular nonfiction. Like spiritual books a lot. Coaching books. Self-help books. Just stuff I find interesting. But I also read Kindle Unlimited romances. A lot of different ones of those. is this dark. 
work with some of these. But I like being seeing people talk about new books I haven't read yet. New authors I haven't tried. And I love Kindle Unlimited. I think it saves a lot of money for me. A few years ago, I talked my mom into finally getting Kindle Unlimited and a Kindle. She loves it too. I usually put books on there for her that I've already read. But she reads faster than I do sometimes, so I have to get her books first. Or different kinds of books. She likes some of the cozy mysteries. I've read some of those, but I don't like them as well sometimes. It depends on the story. But like I said, I do a lot of reading. And I do a lot of online classes, just different things, coaching, yoga, massage stuff, fitness. So I try to make time for that. I try to make time for expanding my mind. Oh, look at that. I've been talking for a half hour. I didn't think I'd be able to make that this video that long. Well, I think we've covered everything for now. Like you said, let me know if you want to hear more about what I like to read. Suggest stuff for me to watch on demand. Suggest books for me to read if you want. Thank you for watching.